there was this incident in 1965 where Tallulah Bankhead walked into a recording studio and she had to re-record or loop uh, a couple lines from the film Die, Die, My Darling. Of course, when you try to get an inebriated, uh, smoking, pill-popping woman to focus on looping a line of a dialogue, you know, it's uh, the, the situation is just ends up being crazy and fun. She puts out an awful lot of obstacles, the drinking, the smoking, the, the, and then just being resistant. Before Lindsay Lohan, before Britney Spears, Tallulah was doing things that were so outrageous for the 1940s and 50s that today celebrities wouldn't even think of doing. You know, she was very, very out there. She was promiscuous, she was an alcoholic, she was a drug addict, and she didn't care who knew it. It's not just about looping the dialogue, it's not just about the wittiness and vulgarity of Tallulah Bankhead. You see her humanity to an extent. It's a laugh riot comedy. It's an absolutely side splitting and we've had it in three venues and I don't think New York's gonna be any different.